I would like to work in developing countries to help people, help children especially. It's, it's quite shocking, you know, it's, even in Egypt, it's a very, you know, touristy country, but they've got like 8% of children dying from malnutrition every year. So I would like to volunteer in these countries to help them develop some facilities, again, um, for, you know, not just nutrition, but to help the general public. I've had a lovely time at Brooks. I've met people that I never would have met in my normal life, in my regular life, if I hadn't gone to Brooks. The lecturers here are very helpful. They've definitely challenged me to do my best. They've definitely challenged me academically. We've been like a family. I've, I've definitely had a great time at Brooks. Back in second year, it was a module called professional practice. So all the students had to do a work placement. Um, I went to volunteer with the local Oxford Food Bank. It was really fun, so my job was to run around Oxford with the van driver to pick up different donated foods from um, a wholesaler. It was quite shocking of you know, how much food people throw away every day. It just made me reflect on how my future practice can be. For example, at least we have to educate people more about the difference between the you know, use by day and the best before day because a lot of food are actually still safe to consume. Maria from the Career Service Centre has helped me a lot during, especially during my preparation for my master's interview um, a few months ago. She definitely has got all the skills needed to help me to get the job, or in my case, a place at a very competitive master's course. I can tell you that because I got an offer. We did a mock interview at the time, and then we have it filmed as well. So, and then we looked at the interview, and then she picked up areas that she thought I could improve on. During third year, because our lecturers are trying to prepare us for work in the future, because we're graduating soon. So they organized a career night. So we've had different industry leading food specialists, like producers, manufacturers, they, they came in to talk to us. It was a lovely night, so I had the opportunity to sort of do some networking to talk about what the opportunities and options are when I graduate. So my long-term goal is to establish myself as a public health dietitian, especially in the area of you know, policy making, because that's where I think I can actually make an impact. I think more importantly, the sort of the main advantage that I've gained from, you know, by doing this AFN accredited course it's sort of that standing out from the crowd. It helps me a lot um, to stand out in the very competitive and busy job market.